All right, just uploaded that Instagram Q&A that I promised you guys a while back. Filmed it uh, about a week ago. Finally got around to uh, uploading it. Uh, sorry for the lack of uploads. Just um, really not a lack. I mean, I'm still with you guys, you know, on Instagram and stuff. But also, just I, mean, I had a four-day break. Usually, I kind of try to upload maybe like every other day. But um, I had to take a little break just because of finals and whatnot. But uh, today is Monday, so Wednesday. Finals are over. So right now I'm doing some psychology homework, highlighting and reading and going over the study guide. Um, this is like my only uh, cue into the final. Everything else is like on recent chapters, which helped a lot, you know. Not too much reviewing, but this one I'm really reviewing on. Uh, I'm going to be hitting legs here, get out of here and hit some legs. So I'm sipping on my uh, C4. I'm actually doing C4 today. Uh, I had a little sample packet that I got from uh, my coach Kyle Hunt. Uh, he sent me some samples, so blue raspberry. Sipping on that. If you guys have been watching me, you guys know I take the Unleashed Extreme by Barthel Fitness. But, you know, always got to change it up. Try new flavors, try new things. Two scoops of C4, doing some legs tonight. Haven't done legs for a while, so we'll see how that goes. Um, other than that, after the legs, I'm trying to make it quick. Uh, the staple movement, squats, leg press, uh, lunges, probably some Romanian deads, and maybe superset some extensions and curls, leg curls and extensions, and after that, um, we'll see if we do cardio. If not, I'll do it tomorrow for sure, but I don't know if I'll have time tonight because I still got to get this psychology done, and I always I have four cardio sessions a week, and today's Monday, so I have a whole week in front of me to do cardio, but I like to get one session done on Monday, but again, time permitting, we will see. Other than that, guys, I'll try to get some footage on squats and leg workout. Other than that, if you guys are in college, I have finals this week, hopefully all of you guys are doing well on them. Uh, don't give up yet guys, you know, just a few more days and we're done for a good, good, uh, five weeks, I would say, maybe, maybe more, maybe less for some colleges, but for me, I believe it's five, maybe six, five weeks. Other than that, let's go kill some legs. Alright, I was just about to go to the gym, actually, and we got a package from Brian Martinez over at Local Fit. He, uh, reached out to me and told me he was sending out a shirt. Got it today, so shout out to you, Brian Martinez. Funny thing, I don't know if you... Well, excuse me, I don't know if you guys know, my last name is Gonzalez, right? And when I got the package, they wrote family on it, just because Martinez and Gonzalez, I thought, were related, so. Who knows? But, also, so here's what the shirt looks like. Looks cool. I'll give it a wash and wear it next gym day for sure. Extra large. Also, Brian hooked me up with, uh... Couple of whey protein samples. This one is uh, vanilla ice cream, and this one is chocolate fudge. Two different companies. I've seen this one before at stores, but I've never seen this one. So this is very intriguing. Can't wait to try it. And then just two of these uh, energy, uh, guessing like pre-workout kind of stuff. And then just you know business card and a little note. Um, won't get into that stuff, but. Huge shout out to Brian Martinez at Local Fit. So thank you, Brian. I'll have his channel in the description box down below. Also on the hiccups, man. I'll have his channel on the description box down below and also on the screen. Go over, check him out, and subscribe to his channel. Awesome. Now, let's go hit legs. Monster. Yeah, that's right. 
chilling in bed, watching some YouTube, eating food. Life does not get better than this, guys. Them end of semester feels. Mmm. Alright. What's up guys, at first I'm just going to have uh, some deadlift footage playing like I did earlier in the video with the squats, just some raw footage, but I just want to touch base and uh, talk to you guys about something. Uh, on these deadlifts right now are my hip placement, I was just wondering if any of you guys think, you know, on critique wise, uh, if you guys can critique the form. Uh, personally, I feel that my hips may be a little too high up in the air before I start uh, lifting, but uh, that, that may just, just be me. I also noticed it too after I watched it back in the gym and the rest of the sets I did, I focused on keeping my hips lower, which you will see in the next clip. Um, but other than that, I think they're still a little high in the next clip. Just want to see what you guys think. And also, a little butt thing in the air is something I like to do to reset the deadlift uh, just for conventional. Uh, it really helps reset everything just because I'm, I'm a little tall, guys, for the conventional. Uh, but uh, I like doing conventional on back back day as opposed to the sumo deadlift uh i think it just feels better but yeah see how i'm keeping the uh hips a little bit lower than last time but i still think they're a little too high guys what do you guys think um that's something i will definitely work on in the future is keeping my hips a little bit lower before setting uh setting up and lifting the weight other than that guys hope you enjoy the rest of the vlog there's a few more clips at the end so stay tuned also, if you could, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, like this video, and I'll see you guys in the next clip. Alright guys, just finished my back and bicep workout. Only got deadlifts on film, sorry about that. But I figured I would do a little bit of uh, an update. Um, right now we're, we're about 203 pounds, um, lowest I've gotten on the, on this cut was 195, holidays happened, Thanksgiving happened, um, you gotta live life if you're not, you know, in contest prep, so, we'll be back in the 190s probably in a few days, I'm losing about two pounds of water, uh, a day, so, we'll be back to fat loss, probably, I would say by the end of the week, so. Back. <sighs> All right. So I just gave this a try, that sample vanilla ice cream, and I did this in one sip. This may be the best tasting vanilla protein I have ever had. I usually hate vanilla protein, so I was just expecting to down this down just for uh, 25 grams of protein. I didn't want to use uh, any of my strawberry MTS because I'm kind of like packing up right now because I'm leaving tomorrow. So I figured, oh, I have samples handy. Uh, I'm just going to chug this down to hope for the best because I hate vanilla protein. But this is actually very good. Like, it's really good. I can't even taste like, usually there's like something in vanilla that I do not like. Like that fake vanilla, but this doesn't have it. So, this is probably one of the best tasting vanilla proteins I've ever had in my life. Very good. God, I wish I had more of that.